NASA and Boeing will be holding off bringing astronauts Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams back from the International Space Station. Officials say they're still gathering data on the test mission that saw the duo dock to the ISS nearly two weeks ago. This is the third time Boeing Starliner has seen its return trip delayed. The spacecraft has faced a number of issues in both the lead up to the launch and on this mission. Five of the more than two dozen rocket thrusters were not functioning properly on the flight to the ISS and Starliner saw five helium leaks over that journey. The main thing that I think most people will be worried about is the structural integrity of the craft. Um, and anytime you have a leak, uh, there's a potential for things coming loose. NASA and Boeing say those leaks have subsided and it tested the thrusters this weekend with all but one fully functional. The project has been plagued by delays and running over budget by $1.5 billion. NASA's identical program with SpaceX has seen dozens of completed trips to the ISS. This test flight was planned to run for a week, but can last up to 45 days. Starliner's first mission is set for next year, and we'll see three astronauts, including Canadian Joshua Kutrick, take Starliner to the ISS for six months. Kyle Benning, Global News.